Hello and welcome back to Wasteland 3. So, I am going to head out here, but before I do, I actually do want to show you something about saving, or particularly loading. Right, so if you're loading games, you might be seeing it like I'm seeing it here, and you might be thinking, this is just ridiculous. I mean, actually, here's my small rant. Uh, this is a game on PC. You can have more than 10 slaves. You know, it's allowed to have more than 10 saves on, on a PC game. I know for a console game, obviously not, but you know, you, you were making it for PC too. Um, I didn't realize you could sort by date here. I Like, it, there's no indication that you could ever do that. But if you click date, you can sort, and this becomes so much easier. I mean, you have to click it twice to get the useful one, but still, that is so much more useful than anything else. So I thought I'd just do that little rant. Anyway, um, I believe we're ready to head out, aren't we? Uh, our mission log is just unwelcome guests travel to the bazaar. I'm actually not going to do that right away. What we're going to do when we head out here, uh, yes, I would love to leave to go to the world map, is we're actually going to head north. We're going to head towards that one that we couldn't do previously. And the reason we're going to head towards that is if it's similar to the Ag Center High Pool one from Wasteland 2, there will be another quest at that second one, which will be like the failure quest, which would be interesting because I want to know what happened. Now, obviously, there might just be nothing there, but maybe there's loot or something. The chances of there being absolutely nothing there whatsoever seems unlikely to me. So, you know, even if we just get loot, we get some XP for turning up. Seems like a good idea to me. So, let's go. Oh, for a second there, I thought we had something happening. Oh, yes, I forgot you can't use the, you can't move the camera here. So, you want to head down here and then up. We probably want to head this way as well, but I think that's the way to Aspen. Yeah. So, let's head down this way. I would love to be able to move the camera so we can see where we're going. It seems like a very odd decision to not let you. I'm not entirely sure why they did that, but hey, whatever. Uh, we're now going to head up this. Wait, what's this? Is this something? It is something. Oh, we didn't just destroy everything around. What is it? Natural shelter. An overhanging rock surrounded by dense brush provides some shelter from the weather and prying eyes. Um, Search the area. Animals have been here recently, they could still be around. So we can take turns watching in case the animals come back or track the animals and kill them for food. Let's animal whisper them. The animals didn't come back, everyone got a decent night's rest. You feel great when you wake up. Oh, is that just increase that probably just makes our health go to full? Interesting. Okay, well we're gonna head up this way. Um Yeah, straight through the center here. Nope, apparently not. Is this where we needed to go, or is this where we needed to go? Sorry. Uh, I don't know what this path is. Oh, wait, that's Colorado Springs. That path looks like it's got radiation on it, right? Radiation, watch out. That glowing green cloud ahead is radiation. Radiation, get damage your squad, make them sick, give them mutations, and even kill them. The severity level of a radiation hazard is shown on the Gyro counter on the top of the screen. To navigate the fallout, find and install upgrades to the Kodiak to boost its radiation resistance. Ah, so that's how you do that in this game. Interesting. So this must be what I'm looking for, right? Maybe? No? I think this isn't actually what we're looking for. This is just a random thing. Lug nuts. An Arapaho uh, cube truck and its escort are making a delivery at, fortifi at, at Fortified Farmhouse. I should probably say at a Fortified harm Farmhouse. The driver looks around as you approach. Don't know who you are, but if you ain't looking for trouble, I got some stuff to trade. Uh, we hear the Arapaho are the best mechanics in Colorado. Would you mind looking at our Kodiak? Well, I ain't the best mechanic in Colorado, but how can I say no after a thorough ass kissing? Um, we don't trade, we take. Now, get your hands up, sucker. No. Any highway wisdom for us, friends? Maintain your vehicle and don't stop if you don't have to. These days, a flat tire or a stalled engine could be the end of you, consumed by the elements. And I don't just mean the weather. If you get me. All right, show us what you got. Just some odds and ends I've taken in trade. Might be useful. Okay, so what has he got? So he's got tank helmet. Okay. Trooper helmet. 5% hit is not bad. Yeah, that seems really cool. Uh, that is... I'm not entirely sure what's up with that one. It doesn't tell me how strong it is. Because surely it should... Oh, no. I... Wait, that's armor... Oh, it's armor 9. Oh, wow. It does tell me. Yeah, okay. That's pretty good. Minus 3% for a barter bonus, don't forget that. 
Uh, we got the Perkel Model 85, which is obviously better than what we're using. If I go and check that against, Spar uh, against Sparhawk here, we can shift to compare items. Yeah, that's just like... That's just superior in every way, and we can use it. I see no reason not to buy that right now. I mean, we have the money. I'm going to sell my junk as well. I would like to buy this. Also, does that really say you cannot afford this item when you try and sell junk? That is... That's, uh, ooh, that's not great. Uh, I think I'll buy this as well. You have seven strength. I'm going to buy this helmet as well for you, I think. Yeah, let's buy this helmet as well. Anything else that we need? I think I might actually buy, I think I have suture kits. Do I have, wait, yeah, does it tell me how many I have? No, that would be useful in this one to say, say like, you have this much of this item. Uh, we might be okay. How much? It, yeah, we don't know. Uh, what does our new sniper do? I should sell my old snipers. Yeah, are these sorted? It'll be at the bottom, or is it just in, in here somewhere now? It's just in here somewhere now. I should sell things like our knives as well, but we don't really get very much for it, and I might as well... We doesn't, don't appear to have any limit on our inventory, so I might as well wait till we have more. That uses... That, it uses the same ammo as everything else. Okay. So I might... What about if I just buy it all? Sure. That's fine. Cool. Close. Uh, Sparhawk, I'm now going to equip you with this new weapon. If I can find it, the Perkel. Nice. And then let's modify it. So I can put this one on it to give you more hit. Yep. Uh, I can put this one on it to give you more magazine size. Seems great to me. Now I think Lucia here should be the one who gets our hit helmet. The reason why she should get the hit helmet is because uh, she has an attack which if you uh, lower your hit will then give her back AP. So that seems fantastic. So we're going to give her that. Anyone not wearing a helmet? You're wearing a helmet currently. You're wearing the mechanics one. Okay, that's fine. You're wearing the strength helmet. Is that better or worse than the uh, other helmets we got? Uh, the other ones give crit chance. I don't know. It's kind of... Six of one, half a dozen of the other. This one, however, is a straight up upgrade. Does it look any good? It looks pretty cool. Yeah, you're, you're using that one. You are not using a helmet, so you should at least have the crit chance helmet on. That seems good to me. And then, actually, I think you should probably have the crit chance helmet as well. I think that will end up better for you in the long run. I think the chance of a crit is better than one uh, armor, probably. Yeah, let's go with that. I could also upgrade... Actually, you know what I should do? I should double check whether I can upgrade her weapon. Uh, no. Also, is that the best weapon she's got? She can use all of these. Oh yeah, her revolver is just superior in every way. What about uh, this? Do we have a better shotgun? We have a flamethrower, which requires big guns. We should probably look into big guns at some point on somebody. Um, hmm. I'm still trying to find the shot. There's the coach guns. Oh, so the skeet hunter is better. Okay, um... Coach gun is better than that. Okay, anything else? Uh, now these are all just coach guns. Okay, so that seems good for us right now. Seeing whether anyone else has an upgrade marksman rifle, I believe is the right one here. You, um, I think you were using the greaser and that's the only one. We do have a couple of Tommy guns. Are they, I think that's what he's using anyway. Yeah, okay. And then these. I think actually, yeah, I think it does it in order. Yeah, so I think that uh, the ones that are further left are the better ones. So this does more damage. Okay. Uh, as This has more pen as well. It has a 25% to uh, do burn. It does 30% less against humans, animals, and things. But it does have a 25% chance to do burn. And it does go through armor. I think I'm going to put on the pulse gun instead. It also gives his two guns as, as you know, distinct purpose to them. And you're currently using an assault rifle that requires level 2. Do you actually have any skills in anything? Uh, no. So why don't I just give you the flamethrower? I mean, if you don't have a skill, I might as well just give you the... F actually, you know what? You can have the RPG. Because you have a skill in... Uh, yeah, in explosives. Then you don't... Act actually, you also have a skill in explosives. Hmm. I could just give you the flamethrower anyway, but you know what? That's fine. Two of them can have RPG weapons. At least then they'll be... Uh, they'll have... Uh, yeah, some ammo. I could give you the flamethrower. It does minus 100... Sorry, it's minus 100% crit and strike. 
and there's a lot less hit. I was just wondering whether that's worth doing. Hmm. Uh, I think the strike is charged per weapon, but if it isn't charged per weapon, that could be interesting. Let's try to see what else we got. We do also have, like, this heavy machine gun, which could be interesting. It's only minus 10% hit, actually. You know what? Just equip it. So, oh my lord, that looks brilliant. But just equip it so we have something equipped. Right. Up to Hoon Headstead. Or Hoon, Hoon, Hoon Homestead. Ooh, what's this? That looks horrific. Apparently that is nothing. Alright then. It's fine. Wasn't really what it looks like, but you know. Alright then. Ah, so this place appears to be on fire. A large but rustic shack made uh, to house the multi-generational Hoon family and their goats. Well, uh, I suspect the multi-generational Hoon family are now probably a single-generational Hoon family, and they may just have a singular goat. That's my guess, anyway. Lieutenant Connie Zeng was Angela Death's second-in-command for the Colorado Advance Team. That's intriguing. Uh, I don't think we know who that is yet, but it's intriguing that it would tell us. I assume that she's going to become important at some point. Maybe she's in a different faction now, and not the Rangers. Hmm. Or maybe we'll find her at some point. I don't know. Maybe she's here. Hey, we discovered something. So right away, the map does not look promising. So let's grab this. What have we got? We have frag grenades, some lance plates, which are armor mods. We got a weapon thing. Okay, we'll grab all that. Uh, everyone else feel like following? Yeah. So we have this side path over here. Might be worth checking out. Oh, it auto-saved for me. It's very dark here. Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to keep checking out the side path to see if there's anything in it. Uh, there's a waste wolf. We already have a dog, though. A grave. He took everything, so I choose nothing. Okay. And there's a waste wolf outside it. Can we speak to the waste wolf? No, it's just a tame. Hmm, I wonder what's up with that, then. So it's somebody's grave. Might be the Hoon family's grave. Looking at the fact that they're there. Oh, we're all taking the ladder down. They do not look healthy. In fact, you know what? Take the ladder back up. I know I just got them all to come. It's not like we're going to do anything for them now. We might as well walk along the edge here. Uh, I'm also going to get heat to walk in front. Maybe it should be Omen if we're actually going to fight. I don't think we will, though. I think this is just an aftermath scene. It has a toaster in it, though. Can't go that way. Okay, so that way's just a nope way. Toast to repair, it only requires level 1. Might as well repair it. Hey, we got a molded gold toaster case. Nice! And cone angle for shotguns. Might be useful. A toxic cell. Once afflicted, the cell delivers slow drips of toxin into the weapon's contact surface. Ooh. So a chance of poisoned on a melee weapon. Could be interesting. My only problem with things like poison in this sort of game is that it always feels like if you don't kill, like if you have to kill something in multiple turns, oh yeah, poison becomes great. You have to kill something in one turn, like just one singular turn so it doesn't hit you back, poison suddenly becomes useless. So that's kind of what my thoughts are. Increases automatic weapons B1. I think that means, I think that was by one. The Malham Mug Filler. Okay. Uh, who uses automatics out of our base group? I mean, you use automatics, but I don't know if I want to use it on you. I guess we'll just keep it. Keep the uh, planet going. So I believe that this area, I'm looking at it here. Uh, I believe this area must be just here so you can collect, like, the toaster stuff. Yeah. That, that must be its only purpose in life, is to be like, here's where the toaster stuff is. Yeah. I think so. Oh, wait, we can open the back door. Keep going. Mm, yeah, there's still nothing back here. Interesting. So I guess this is where there was going to be some sort of event or something, but didn't really happen for us because we obviously didn't come and save these guys. So, yeah, okay, time to leave. 
let's head to the other thing that we have on our map. We do want to explore the map at some point, but um, I suspect that the random encounters on the map are going to be quite difficult. So I, I think we should explore closer to an ending point. Like, well, maybe in another 10 levels or something. I don't know. What level are we? We're probably level 10 and that's going to be unreasonable. But yeah, we'll explore the map fully at some point. Okay, so once it loads up, which it is loading fairly quickly, which isn't uh, bad at all. Hopefully it's loading quickly and it wasn't just play, you know, playing with me. Nope, that's fine. Right, map. At least we know what happened to him. So we want to head down here and across, I think. So we want to head down to the caravan or we can head down to the first turning and turn there. Let's do that. It at least takes us a different route. Yeah, down here. So we want to continue this way. There are some off-road bits we could go on here, but I think it's like, is it here or is it just a little further? Okay. I was thinking if it's here, then that doesn't seem right. There we go. Let's cross off-road. Straight through. Let me check our map here. So I'm just checking around. Is there anything over here? No. Okay, that's fine, because that's where we kind of came from. We hear a lot of shooting. Although I think that's the lightning, which appears to be very strong around here. Your mouse controlling the headlights is weird. Uh, okay, so we got another lug nuts. Or whatever this place is. BB gun. A burly woman leans her head out of the window of a Marshall's assault truck. Fucking rangers. Go on back to Arizona and let real police get shit done. As she drives off, you see the back of the truck is piled with impounded evidence. Oh wow. So you can just lose shops through having no reputation? Okay. Well, actually, it says that there's a path here, so let's take it. Oh, there's a deer. Run it over. Okay, apparently you can do that. That's, um, horrific thing of the day. Okay. My bad. I mean, it was eating meat. As a deer, that seems like something we shouldn't encourage. You know, evolutionary-wise, if the deer was eating meat, then, uh, you know, it shouldn't be allowed to live. It'll encourage more to eat meat. That's all I'm saying. Right. Along here. Yes, I think this is the way to the bazaar. Oye, amigos! As soon show at the Clown Museum in Arriba! Take the tour, then visit El Big Top and learn what it really means to be a clown! Children under 10 are free! We can't get enough of those cabronitos! Ha <laughs> Arriba, los payasos! Uh, that's a little bit random. We're still going down here then? Anything else happening? Oh, there's... Hello all. My name is Flab, and it is my pleasure to bid you welcome to the bazaar. Come in, for the night air is chill. Your wallet heavy, and our goods plentiful. Bring us your wealthy, your rich, your full purses. And if you can't afford it, just stay away! This has been a Monster Army production! <laughs> yeah, but what's up with this clown museum? A once humble clown themed roadside attraction. Oh, there's more! Okay. Monster movie facts. Did you know that the movie Escape from Psycho Prison was filmed right here in Colorado at the old Supermax Prison? Oh, it's true! I was working in the lab late one night. Wait, is this the Monster Mash? It is. It's the Monster Mash. And suddenly, to my surprise, we did the monster. The monster. 
Although, it is a cover of the Monster Mash. It's not quite as, uh, you know, intense as this usually. I might just let it play out. It's more intense. Okay. Okay, then. Seems a little random, but I'm happy I recognized it from the lyrics. Uh, once a humble clown-themed roadside attraction, after the apocalypse it became the holiest of holy sites for the villainous Pyaos. Sure, let's go in. What's the worst that could happen? Los Pyaos are a gang of sadistic killers who believe the apocalypse was a vicious joke, and they are the punchline. Alright then, I'm guessing that this guy need a Los Shot. That would be my guess. Um, do you reckon that they are dressed up as creepy clowns? That would be my guess. Let's have a look once we get in there. So, let me just do something that I've been wanting to do for a while. Ooh, you can turn the uh, camera around. Okay, so this is the front gate. There doesn't appear to be another route, but I'm going to keep looking for another route. Interestingly, if I hold down... No, they are hey, following I'm me. Honest. The fuck you doing here? Uh... Hello? Oh, I was going to ask you the same question. We came to see the clown museum. This ain't just a museum, Bendejo. It's sacred ground. A shrine to the great joke. And you're going to get it! Arriba, payasos! Arima! What? Estás ready, I guess they get to go first. They demoralized just one member of our group. That's fine. Two members of our group. We've been demoral. Uh, well, it's a clown you demoralized. Not clown, clone. Close enough. Uh. Okay, smoke grenade. That's fine. This is fine. You managed to poison someone. That's amazing. How did you even achieve this? Alright. Move number one. Run up here and hit him. It's a simple move. And there are simple reasons why we did it. Because, well, we could. Uh, truck. Can you shoot anyone? 68%? I'll take those odds. Okay, kill this one as well. Okay, that's fine. Uh, Sparhawk, I would love for you to get behind this tiny bit of cover. We shoot out of it though? Mm, reasonably. 
There are a few people we could shoot. Heat. I think this is your tree. I don't know if that's what we need you to do, but that, that's definitely where we're going to start you. Lucia, this is your tree. Jody, I think you have to run over here just to get some sort of cover. Marshall Kwan. I don't believe you're behind cover. I believe you're just standing behind Omen. I'm going to get you round this way. Okay. Now you do have a precision strike that we can just apply onto somebody. How about this guy? I would love to aim for the head, please. Didn't get him, but that's okay. Uh, you could shoot him again. I mean, that was actually only a 34% chance, so that's amazing. You can't shoot anybody, that's fine. I think her having a science weapon secondary, or at least the science weapon we have right now is a little bit unfortunate, but that's fine. I think I'm going to use Demoralize here. I can hit th three members with, with it, so it seems pretty good. Yeah. Not much of a threat. That's good. Demoralize him. Uh. So what does this actually do? Hit chance goes down. Crit chance goes down. Oh. Well, I guess I could try hitting this guy. At least it should unlock my precision for next turn. It does. Okay. Uh, you don't have anything to do, so I'm gonna prepare you. Lucia, uh, you can actually take a shot here, but it's not going to do anything. So I guess I'm just going to defend with you. Oh, it's heat. Never mind. Lucia? Yeah, still not going to do anything. I could use double barrel. Oh, wait. I want to switch to this one. Uh, snapshot's the only thing I can do. What if I did double barrel? Uh, so it fires twice, but has a lower hit chance. Okay. How about this? How much damage does it do? Not really that much. Do I think I'll defend on you? Seems good. And I'll just defend here. I don't think we need to prepare for next turn. They're a little bit demoralized, which is good. So you just apply another demoralized. That's absolutely fine. Destroyed her cover. Not great, but at least she had it for this turn. Hmm. Okay, did a little damage. Lots of smoke. Seems kind of bad, because now they can't see. Okay. Oh, and they were poisoned as well. Dogs didn't work. Clone is over here. Hopefully didn't work. Not very much. Okay. Sparhawk has, like, very low chance of hitting a bunch of people, but could use this to try and get somebody. How about you? Yeah. I go for a headshot. That'll do it. That'll do it. Okay, Omen. This one. Nice. Run in here. And then I might prepare an ambush next turn with her. Marshal Kwan, you can shoot. Should shoot. Hey, we blinded him with that as well. Nice. Lucia Wesson. Um, what's her chance of hitting the trick shot? 40. Hmm. It's not very high. Uh, let's just shoot. Okay. That was reasonable. I can try um, the snapshot as well. It's only a 30, so I'm not going to do that. Alright. Move forward. Haven't hit anyone yet, which is good. Uh, that's a 95. Yeah, shoot. Nice. Back here, you're not actually behind cover, but I could move you behind here. Give you a little bit more cover. And just take a shot. Nice! I think that was a crit. Um, now, I can get people more AP, so I get 2 AP here. I don't think we need it, though. Is there anything else I want you to do, then? Uh... Oh, probably med hypo. And then just prepare. Save, save your AP for next turn. Then everybody else I'm going to defend. It'd be nice if you could just, like, set a mass move for, like, this. I think you're am ambushing. But set, like, a mass. I just want you to defend this turn. Yeah. Try and raise your evasion truck. Alright, that's another demoralize. 
It's okay. It's a lot of damage. I'm one's down. Okay. You're blinded, so hopefully you can't hit. Yeah. There's our ambush. Perfect. We got a lucky evade. Nice. Luck did something. Clone's doing something. Dog's still going. Very nice. Okay. First move is first. Lucia Weston. Res. So 95 there. Can I hit with the trick shot? 60? Try it. Nice. Now we can move that into precision. Go for the headshot for the extra damage. Didn't get it, but that's okay. Jody, shoot. I was a 95%, Jody. You want to explain yourself, or no? We're just gonna ignore that. Uh, Sparhawk. Yeah. Thought thought you might be able to do that. Okay. Omen. This guy hit him. Hit him. Probably should have shot from further away first. But that's okay. Get him. Out of ammo. Switch weapon. We don't have enough. Wait, I'm I'm still out. Wait, I'm not out of ammo. I'm just out of range here. Okay. Fair enough. Uh, although, actually, what I could do is rally now. I can't rally because I don't have enough AP, which is ironic because that's what rally will do for everyone else. All right, shoot. Nice. Uh, what's this? Unload? Leave nothing behind. It's 4 AP. All right. I can shoot you here, but I could also unload. Let's see how much. 5%. Go for it. Okay. Well, it was fairly bad. Let's defend. Defend. You know what? The truck has another shot. Why don't you shoot truck? We did it. I just realized the truck had more uh, turn. Okay. Uh, yeah, you probably need to heal. Let's just quickly chuck on a um, medic kit for her. And then just heal her up. What's the negative she's got on here? Gouge die, lowers hit chance. It's actually not that bad. Let's also lower her downtime though. Do I have another injury kit? Or do I just have one? I have six. Yeah, I might stick that on. I think actually they were already on her. Uh, Marshall Kwan, do you have a hypo or something? No. Well, I guess I could uh, injury kit you two. I mean, I could walk back. The optimal thing to do right now would just be... To... Am I out? Yeah. No. I guess I could only equip two at a time or something. Anyway. You're the best. Uh, yeah, do this. Lucky heal bonus. But yeah, the optimal move is yeah. to go back to the Ranger Citadel. But in need. That's okay. You're the best. Let's level up here. Attributes. What are we going for? Intelligence isn't really that worth it. I think awareness is pretty good. It's pretty sweet. Yeah, I think awareness might be there. Either that or coordination for the extra action point. I actually already have it, so it'd have to be two coordination if we're going for another action. I think just the hit chance is so good that we shouldn't say no to it. Yeah. Skills wise, um, we do like her being a mechanic. Does she get anything for that level? No. Weird science, does she get anything for that level? Microwave research. You figured out how to weaponize the excitement of matter and ruined all your silverware. What's that mean? In real terms. Energy damage is increased by 0 0.5 uh, bonus damage for every point of armor the target has. Okay. Intriguing. I don't know if that's good. Just seeing what other options we got here. Uh, I mean, it is good. Don't get me wrong. Uh, I think I'll take it. Yeah. Uh, it seems like a good one for her as well. It gives her a very specific thing that she's good at that nobody else is. And then we'll grab microwave research. It's only good on our secondary weapon, but still good. 
What's the top level? Energy attacks have a 10% chance to electrocute enemies, dealing damage to them and anyone standing nearby. Ooh, nice. Okay. Loot. Just pick someone and loot them. So we got ammo. We got a punctured clown nose. More stuff, more stuff, more stuff, more stuff. Just generic stuff there. This guy, we've already looted, already looted, already looted, already looted. Nice. Uh, these are ballerinas. They um, creep me out. What's up with these guys? The animatronic ballerina is currently deactivated. A maintenance panel is open. Is frozen open. Inspect it. Clearing some snow away, you see one part. One of the, uh, its parts has fallen out, leaving an obvious gap. If you could find a replacement part, it would be easy to fix. Repair it. Only takes a few seconds to replace the missing part. The access panel snaps shut. This animatronic ballerina is currently turned off. A brightly colored power switch is mounted at her feet. Turn it on. The animatronic ballerina is currently dancing. A brightly colored power switch is mounted at her feet. Step away. I have the feeling this is going to be a puzzle. Let's uh, try and figure it out then. Oh, there's another gyro. Okay, so I'm guessing we're meant to find all of these and then like fix all the ballerinas. Yeah, swoop the power on. Oh, it's now dancing. Okay, step away. Right, this one. Uh, repair. Cool. Flip the power on. Uh, step away. Repair. Or whatever we need to do. Swoop. Flip the switch. Step away. Wait, did that didn't seem to work? Okay, that worked. This thing, can we repair it? Probably don't have enough of what we need. Yeah, I need another repair thing. This one didn't seem to spin. All right, I'd, okay. Maybe you have to turn them all on at once or something. I don't know, we don't have what we need, basically. Weathered poster, ooh, buried item. Please collect it, scrap, okay. Uh, though mostly worn away, a few flakes of thick clown, make uh, clown makeup still ma uh, cling to the face. Uh, excuse me? Uh, I have an idea. What if... Uh, secondary was main. shoot it? Nah, I thought maybe you could shoot it though. Ooh, I keep pressing the wrong button to cancel. It does work, but it just opens the menu as well. Kinda thought that might melt the snow. Not entirely sure what's up with that. Okay, I'll give her um, her rocket launcher back. Sure. Uh, then I'll give her her submachine gun back. Wait, was she using a nailer? It's really not very good. I should get her a better weapon. Okay, cool. Everybody with us? We've got these ballerinas, nothing with them. Oh, there's another buried thing. Dog, I need you to stand off it. Hmm. More scrap. I mean, I could attack the clone, but I think... Uh, not clone, I could atta attack the, um... The corpse. But, yeah, I can't do that. There's someone called Mirian in here. And there's a pig. Uh, intercom? What do you want? Open up! We want to see the museum! You got a ticket? Uh, ticket? We don't need no stinking ticket. No ticket, no admittance. Get lost, pendejos! What do you want now? Sorry, wrong number. That's supposed to be funny? Goodbye. Get lost, pendejos! Uh, okay. So we need a ticket. Although, obviously, we can't get a ticket, but that's okay. Mallets. Scribbled uh, below in crayon. One clown stands alone. Ten clowns laugh at each other as the ball rolls. Another enters. Requires power. This is powered by... 
Wait, by this thing? So if I... Yeah, this looks like it's behind here. Do I need to knock over these? Nope. It definitely looks like the power is coming from behind there, though. But maybe it's something to do with this puzzle. Maybe that opens the door. I could let ourselves into the pig, but... Um, well, I suppose we can talk to it, so... Let's see. Squee. I'll be taking what you have buried here. It's the last ballerina thing we need. Okay. So, ballerina. Repair it. it. Only takes a few seconds to replace the missing part of the access panel snap shut. The animatronic ballerina is currently switched off. I'll switch it on. Brightly colored uh, power switch is mounted at our feet. Step away. There's something about the dancing ballerinas which is just breathtaking. Wait, really? That's it? It's just breathtaking. That, that's that's what we did. We just made something that's breathtaking. Hmm. This sure seems like there's... Hmm. Sure seems like there's some kind of puzzle here. Oh. That was the puzzle. Alright. Uh, I see Sparhawk. You have the uh, ability to see things that are going to kill us and also simultaneously open things. Seem like a good choice for this job. And steal the drug stash, which has frag grenades in it. And other such drugs as the nitro thrower flame uh, flamethrower. Well, that would be good if we uh, were using flamethrowers. Another ballerina thing, huh? Tax evasion for morons. Ten secrets they don't want you to know. Hmm. Okay. Ooh, and a toaster. Do we need level 6 to repair? Well, let me tell you about our trinket. Um, our trinket is toaster repair, right? Uh, if I can find it. It's in here somewhere. Is it this badge? No. These are all junk. Uh, yeah, all junk, all junk, all junk. Where Where is our toaster repair thing? We definitely ah there we go toast to repair man's badge that put it to six right that does put it to six which is what we need no wait i thought i put it to six or is it six or is it five now maybe that's five because i have the thing on if i take the thing off we're gonna be at six. Oh, sorry at four we're at four okay interesting uh, obviously I want to put on the other one again, but next time we get a level up we have to do toaster repair, which is fine. Right, so let's find this. Equip it. What's also have no trousers on. Should we have some of those? No, oh, no, we don't have any of them. I'll explain it, right. Alright then, everybody. Merge up. Uh, we're gonna let ourselves in. By, uh, letting ourselves in. What do you want now? Open up. You got it, even from the ticket clown out front, he's dead. Not my problem. You don't got a ticket, you don't get in. Help us out, maybe we can come to some kind of arrangement. Well, there's the ballerinas. They've been broke for a while now, and nobody knows how to fix them. If you got them going again, I guess I could let you in. We already fixed them, you want to open the door now? You did? Let me see! Let me see! Cool. Mirian is often doing his stuff. Hello. Or Miron. <laughs> I wanna be a ballerina too! Well, I mean, you have your goal in life. Uh, Clown Cannon. The plaque reads, in memory of Chanclita, the uh, first Hayaso Cannonball. May she rest in peace. The label inside the wig reads, these colors don't run, Penheo. Uh, so this takes us into some kind of clown tent. The big top. Okay, so what about this route? Requires power. Requires us to hit that. Alright, so that's just another way in. I don't think there's actually anything out there. Okay, so this is where we need to go. Also, uh, inscribed on the pins here are the words, your face here. Uh, hello. You dare set foot in there, big top? 
the shrine to the great joke, the blood of El Payaso Rojo stains this sacred ground. Okay. Um. But since when do you assholes talk? Shouldn't you be climbing an invisible rope or something? That's mines. Uh, the great joke? Oh, si, cabrones. El Payaso Rojo taught it to his disciples in this very place. It goes like this. The world is dead. Mock the weak and the stupid. Fuck up their shit for laughs. Or get fucked up yourself. Um, that's the... Wait, uh, El pa uh, pa Payaso Roja? Never heard of him. When our people came to Arriba, the Red Clown was waiting. He went among the weak and the suffering and offered them the wisdom of the apocalypse. Those with the courage to listen were taught the great joke and became his payasos. Um... The wisdom of the apocalypse is a joke? Oh, si, cabrones. El payaso yeah, okay, so we already did that. It to his disciples we don't get it. This oh, you will. <laughs> you will. Payasos, kill the unbelievers. Without hard ass, I don't think we had a way out of that. Hopefully we can go first, though, thanks to our initiative. Your turn. Nice. We have enough initiative to go first. I would love to hack this. Does anyone else have hack? Uh, be only you'd have hack if anyone else has it. Mark target might be interesting, but yeah, nobody else has hack. Dang. So this means that she has to run forward and use hack. I'm gonna use hack. Out of range. There's our hack range. I think I can do it from there. So what? What is our hack? It uses two AP. It uses seven. So I can only go that far and to try and hack, I guess. So let's try that. Let's move up here. Am I within hack range? Out of range. Wait, let me see if I can spot it. Just hoping that it showed us range, but it doesn't. Hmm, okay, that's fine. Uh, I can use rally here though, right? Nope, also costs too much. How about demoralize? Yeah, we'll hit their climb car as well. Just another target. Okay, so at least that does something. Omen? You have a ton of con. This is your turn to run. Ooh, probably all the way up here. We want to go very aggressive on her turn because we want her to be hit out of anybody. Um, okay, so we can turn the hostile an uh, animal against somebody, but I don't see any hostile animals. That's okay. So I would just wait there. Marshall Quan. Here, we take shots. We could, we could start taking shots here. But let's do some shots of this. I know we're not using our better weapon, but that's okay. That's deliberate. I want to use this weaker weapon while we're still in a kind of a bad spot. Can I shoot from here? Yeah, if I can do that. Then just take a spot and then uh, shoot. Yeah, do it. We do want to try this uh, against that though, because it's going to have a lot of armor. Yeah, so we're going to do a lot more damage against it if we use our uh, energy weapon. Okay, um... Let's... Oh, we already are in cover, I think. Yeah, because we're kind of leaning out ra rather than actually being there. That's fine. Um... I think we can take shot a shot here. Uh, just one shot, and that'll do it. Okay. Um, you're in a bit of an odd spot here because you are very short range. So let's move you in here. Doesn't appear to be giving you the right level of cover that we're looking for. Guess I'm going to move up here. It's not great, but at least we can res next turn if we're in real danger. Uh, I'm going to prepare to save an AP. I think I'm also going to prepare here to save an AP. Now that guy is dead, that actually gives me a little bit more confidence. And then defend here because we're not getting that AP. Okay, she's been hit, but she does have lots of armor. Okay, killing some of the... Uh, yes, yeah, killing some of this wall, which is fine. Smile for the birdie, Malone! 
That's a lot of damage on Quan. We definitely want to rance him. So we probably rance him, hack, and then uh, see what else we can do after that. Looks like he failed that throw, is that right? Our dog is severely hurt. Alright, clone and dog are going in. We can get them both back if there are issues, but poison's good. Okay, let's start with you. So Rez seems like must be. What's our hack range? Uh, so we can move two. Wait, what's our AP on this? Cost two. So I can move one AP's worth. So I can only get that far. I guess I can check here, and then if it's too far, then I can just use my other two AP to leave. The range must be right there. I see the range says it's six meters. Hmm, maybe it's not right there. It's also out of range of this. So what's your range? Your range is 12. Okay, so it's well out of range. Uh, get behind this cover again. Res seems to have worked okay though. Uh, is there anything I can do in here that's likely to turn out well? That's our next question. I'm just seeing whether we have any usables that might be worth chucking in. Like a frag grenade could definitely work. Potentially. Could definitely potentially. That's a good one. Uh, we could chuck a drug in. Hmm. So you get 25 evasion for 36 turns, but suffer 10, minus 10% 10 for 720 afterwards. Hmm. Hmm. I'm just seeing what other stuff we have. 3 AP, critical chance. I don't think we need any of that. That's okay. Hmm. Let's think about this here. I think we might just try and kill you. Try again. One more time. That was some reasonable damage and we charged up. Quan, uh, you need healing. Do we have a med hypo? We do indeed. Okay, med hypo. That seems like the most sensible thing to do if you return. Okay. Lucia Wesson. Lucia Wesson. That's a 95, so if I shoot you with this, yeah, it's an 81. That didn't require no skill at all. And we got another thing. Alright, so now I can precision strike, which will actually let us hit this guy or that guy. I'm gonna go for him again. Headshot. Let's go. Didn't get it, but I still have extra... Actually, I don't have any extra AP. I guess I could use this. I go for a 71. Still didn't quite get him. That's alright. We have one. I think I'll use it for evasion. You? Or you could take a shot. You're unlikely to get any. Uh, I guess shoot this thing then. That's fine. Uh, mark target. On, guys. Let's get it in gear. Uh, so it lowers its evasion, which doesn't really matter. Um, can I shoot? I can maybe shoot you, but like not a high chance. Let's shoot this one. All right, I don't have multiple shots. That's fine. I have confetti grenades, but it doesn't really seem to do very much. I also have 4 AP. If that was high armor, I might go for it, but it's not, so... Yeah, I would love to get out of there. I guess I really want to give ourselves the extra uh, AP next turn. Not necessarily on him, but I would love to give us extra AP. Like, not by using that, but by using the rally, but we'll nice see. Save. Definitely got heals. Thanks. That's good. Dog is probably going to die. Demoralize is absolutely fine as your move. Might die to poison this turn as well. That's horrible. That's, that's just hideous. Okay, Lucia is still alive. You killed Dog, which is just not okay. You killed Clone, which is also not okay. Well, I should res. Uh, I don't have anything else to do, so I might just run back. Okay. Uh, let's switch up to... You do a Thundering Strike. 
So we could run up here and use Thundering Strike just to try and do a bunch of damage. The thing is, if you die, we're in a really bad spot. I might hold off and just see where we're at with people. Kill? What's your chance of hitting with this? Like nothing. Okay. What about the snapshot? Even less. Just shooting? I maybe should have used that on the other guy. I don't have enough. Uh, I could try a snapshot anyway. Didn't work. She has to reload next turn, but that's actually good for her. Marshall Kwan. Hmm. All of these are bad spots for him. That's a very bad spot for him. Frag grenade's pretty good, though. Oh, it has to all be within the circle, I think. Okay, let's try that. Oh, it has to be, like, much closer. Uh, well, let's try this, then. They, they needed to be dead, unfortunately. We're out of range. We do extra damage with it, but we are out of range. I think I just saved my AP. I don't think Marshall Kwan's gonna die, hopefully. You can shoot this one. In fact, you can use this on that one, which might let us hit the CPU. Yeah, yeah, which then causes them to go berserk on a 75% chance. Didn't work, but it's almost dead. Thundering Strike could be interesting, but I don't really want to go in that far. I think I'm going to heal. Because that seems fairly safe. Could chuck in a Molotov. Got 5 AP. This uses 3. Hmm. I don't even know if I want to go around that far. We are going to get shot by that one. If I figure out if there's anything I can do to get this thing dead, I think I actually, how much do, do we have a frag grenade in our inventory? We do. We also have an EMP grenade, but we need nerd stuff for that. Let's try frag grenade. That should have a chance of killing, right? It does. And we can hit three of them. Let's go with that. We can hit two of them. Let's go with that. Got it. What? Uh, kind of wish I hadn't done anything now. Right, let's defend. Yeah, prepare. Probably stab yourself with a med hypo. Okay. Let's see what else we got. Melee damage down. Doesn't really matter. Defend. Ready for vengeance. All right. So they're shooting us now. I think I need to take out the clown car to stop reinforcements, probably. Okay. Oh, that was saving for him. Ah, that's a problem. Mmm. This is a major issue. That's kind of okay. Uh, alright. So. First things first, Marshall Kwan needs to be raised. We get leader revival again. Let's have a look. We still have 7 AP. Alright, let's rally. Give us a little bit more AP to work with. And you know what? I could injury kit him as well. You know, I'm gonna heal him. That does mean we can't move, probably. But that's okay. I need him to do he has he has other tasks. Hit with thundering strike. That's taking that one out for this turn. Okay, now because we're in fog, I'm going to attack this guy. Uh, a couple times. Nope, only once, apparently. That's okay. Being in fog is good, though. Should mean that we're a little bit more protected. Lucia Wesson. You can get your 95 against that one. Need to reload, so... I would reload. Followed by a trick shot. Hmm. Will give us a lot of damage if you got the trick shot off. I don't know if it's going to work, though. 
Could also try shooting some of these ones. Hmm. Let's, let's switch back to Sparhawk and see what we got. So I'm going to shoot... Uh, probably going to shoot this one. That then gives us a precision strike against the vehicle. So Treads reduces movement speed. Chassis reduces its armor turret. Uh, reduces its hit chance by 25. Let's try it. It also has a chance to do more damage. Resist cripple. Oh no. It's really bad, right? Okay, um, I'll switch to Jody. Now Jody can also shoot the clown car. Can she shoot it with this thing? She can indeed. Does that say out of range? Where's her range? Let me just see. So her range is there. If I can run out to this thing, I should be able to shoot the clown car. She also hasn't been knocked down yet. Out of ammo? I don't have any ferrets? Oh. That's a problem. Yes. Shoot this one, hope for a crit. Mm, I don't like that. I don't like any of this. Alright. Didn't get a crit, but I did some damage. So you? Hmm. Wait, it costs zero AP for this shot? Oh yeah, because we just reloaded. That's pretty sweet. Headshot. Definitely. Another two spawned? I thought it might at least give us some extra time, but I guess not. Okay, um... Uh, yeah, let's just have a look at what we can do. So I can shoot my own cover, I think that's saying. They don't really want to do that. Let's cancel that. Hmm. I do have four, so I could take a, a very risky shot. That's not going to work. Okay. It uh, could also just chuck some Molotov stuff over here. I'll make them less likely to want to stop off in front of us. Yeah, let's do that. Lucky Mega Crit. And then I don't have any more AP left, or... I still have AP left. Oh, I guess that was our lucky crit there. Alright, take a shot. Uh, okay, I'm now out. I'm now out of things. I would love for you to be forward. I guess I'm going to take prepare. Right. Lucia. Let's do this one. Uh, let's do another defend. And then defend. And we are in cover, so we might be fine. That's good. Couple misses and they're shooting the people around us. That is a very, very dead... Barhawk, I think. They're walking through the fire. All the way in there. I really hate how many of them are running in here. Okay. Wait, who died? He died. Okay, never mind. She was standing out in the open. That was kind of uh, a given. Okay, Marshal Quan. You do extra damage against this thing. I'm tempted to just run and shoot. The only way we're winning is if we kill this, so let's try it. You're not doing extra damage? I thought you were doing extra damage. Guess not. Okay. Uh, well, this should be the easiest shot in the world, so let's try a trick shot. Now I've charged it again. Flame tank. Maybe I'll just go for the headshot. Uh, keep it going. Not enough AP. That's fine. Um, hmm. Let's figure out what to do here. Just try and hit. Try again. Okay, that makes sense, given what, where we're at. Run up here. Let's take our cover spot. It's not great. Jody. Now, you would do more damage had we actually got you your weapon, but you don't. Uh, so. 
as in we don't have any ammo for her weapon. I could mark this, I suppose. And it lowers its evasion, but that doesn't really matter. You can mark it and shoot it. Come on, guys. Let's get it in gear. Resisted marked. Wonderful. Missed a 95. Wonderful. Right, take a shot. Can I choose to reload on my turn without being out of ammo? I can, yeah. Okay, reload. Lucia, uh, you do have a snapshot if you had ammo, but you don't, so I guess we're gonna defend. And then Jody, defend. So let's see how this goes. We're probably screwed, I reckon. So that's huge. That's bad. That's huge. That's okay. Why, why are you shooting your own side? I haven't really figured that out, but that's good. So maybe it's because I shot this earlier. She's still alive. She's holding on. That's not that bad, actually. Never mind, that's, that's awful. I have three down. Uh, so you're down for another turn, you're down for three turns, you're down for two, three turns. Standing in the fucking fire. Okay. Well, I think you should kill this one. Guess not. Okay. Hmm. Jody? Cool. Thanks for your uh, input, Jody. Uh, nothing to worry about, folks. Happens all the time. Jody hasn't gone down yet, so I'm going to run out and revive. Okay. Um. Heat, can you res? You can indeed. That's great. Love it. Just keep stacking these on top of each other. Could hypo, could also just take a shot. I'm not really in a great position, but maybe a shotgun shot would work. I seem to do the job. Yeah, let's do it again. No! Stop spawning enemies! Oh no! Okay, Marshall Kwan. Precision strike the clown car. I should have done this first, I guess. Okay, resist the turret stuff. Well, which one does the most damage? Chassis does the most damage. Try it. Okay, resisted our electrical armor stuff. Shoot it again. That'll do nicely. Thanks. One's down. We can bring her back next turn, I suppose. That's hugely bad. The fact that there's so many of them is just a huge pain. We need to be able to get to Omen and heal her this turn. Maybe Omen RPG hit that side. We're not going to have enough AP to do that. Especially not with Marshall Kwan dead. Oh no, shoot it. Just hope that the uh, combat ends. Nope, combat did not end. Okay. So who needs to be rezzed? Wait, are they down down or are they like... So you need to be rezzed this turn. There's no option other than res you. Alright, let's res you. We down to 4 AP? Is that is that accurate? No, we're down to 2 AP. Yeah, I can try snapshotting. I, I haven't reloaded yet. Only costs 2 AP to reload. I guess we're reloading. Can you... You can res. No, you're out of range. Well, I think I know what I'm doing with you, which is nothing. You can't res either, but can you heal? Yeah, let's quickly uh, mega crit heal. I guess means it didn't use anything. No, okay. That's not what it means. Uh, defend. How somebody is getting to Omen? Don't ask me. That's that's a that's a question for later. Time for a joke. You scared me? Mm, I'm a little scared. I'll admit that. Things have not gone the way I wanted them to. Uh, 
What's up with him? He's dead. Can only be revived by a Nitro Spike or a Doctor. Oh, can still be revived though. Alright. Sparhawk, this might be a solo run for you now. We do have a Nitro Spark though. Do I run or do I stay? I, I, I like, honestly, you just have to sit here, right, and take it. Prepare for the extra, um, yeah, you prepare to try and get the extra AP. Hope they kill themselves. Nah, we're down. Game over. At least you died with your boots on. Well, I mean, at least. Well, what I think we're going to do here is we're going to end the episode there. Thank you for watching. Next time, I think we might take another shot at that fight. I'll consider it. I think what we needed to do there was really focus the clown car. Because the I, what I did is I tried to focus the ads. Because the normal logic for combat is you kill the ads. And then they will, like, you know, if, they're, if you can kill an ad in one shot, that shot's not coming at you. However... I think what I should have done, I kind of forgot Omen had the rocket launcher, is I should have just rocket launchered the um, the vehicle along with everything in the nearby vicinity. That probably would have worked. Anyway, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.